Hey guys, it's Sal from House of Guy Python. So in this week's video, we're just gonna go over my latest clutch, uh, see what we got. So we had five eggs to start, and um, it was a yellow belly pie to our cinnamon hep hide. Uh, so hopefully we got some cool stuff. I'm excited to show it off to you guys, and uh, let's just take a peek at what we got. All right guys, so we're gonna start off with the het here first. So this is what I believe to be a cinnamon yellow belly het pied. So I, I, I'm pretty sure it's yellow belly. I, I found uh, when I was doing some research, the, ten, the yellow belly tends to drag the cinnamon pattern down and kind of these like thinner alien heads at the bottom. Um, and just really nice blushing overall. Now this could just be a cinnamon hep pied because hep pied I find uh, has heavy influence inside of cinnamon. So there is a chance it might not be yellow belly. Uh, I'm gonna let it shed out first obviously and get some opinions, but I am 90% sure that this is yellow belly just based on all the pixelation and, you know, the really nice blushing coming up. And just like I said, those thinner kind of alien heads uh, coming downwards, so. But a uh, nice little female cinnamon uh, yellow belly hep hide. So pretty happy with her. Not sure if I'm gonna hang her, hang on to her or not yet, but uh, we'll see after she, sh after she sheds and uh, we'll kind of, we'll, I wanna finish off my year first before I start selling off any more females, but. Uh, we'll see if I, I hang on to her, but nice little ringer there, kind of, uh, which is pretty typical, I find, even of uh, cinnamon hep pides. But again, just a nice little cinnamon yellow belly hep pied female. All right. All right, next one up here is another little female. So I do believe this is just a female pied. I don't think it's yellow belly. Um, and the next baby I show you, I'll, I'll, I can kind of compare them, but I just don't see that pixelation uh, that I would think yellow belly would have. So I think it's just a nice little pied female, um, which I'm happy about. I wish it had a bit more pattern, but that's okay. I really like the dark neck, uh, really dark neck there. It almost reminds me of a leopard pied, um, but as far as I know, the the male doesn't have leopard in him. Um, he's, a, he's a yellow belly pied, but I don't believe he's leopard, so I'm just gonna call this one a, a pied, obviously. I know sometimes leopard gets thrown around in pied annoyingly, but uh, I do believe this is just a female pied, but nonetheless, happy. I, I'm happy to hit pieds. This is my first pied clutch ever. Um, so it's super exciting to me, and uh, I, pieds got me into this hobby initially, so to be able to produce them after all this time uh, is absolutely amazing. So really happy with this girl. All right, let's move on. All right, so before I put this girl away, I just wanted to kind of compare them so you can see what I mean. So you can see in that pattern, uh, this this is a boy, uh, but yellow belly pied. And you can see in that pattern the difference, um, the pixelation and the coloration. Um, you know, you can just kind of see the overall color is just a bit brighter. These two came out very similar, but you can definitely tell that this one is an apparent yellow belly pied. Uh, the male is a very, very nice um, example, in my opinion. Uh, the, the male uh, sire to this clutch and this baby here, this boy looks exactly like him with the very deep oranges and nice pixelation. But the stripe came through, which is kind of cool. So uh, put this girl away here and we can concentrate on this boy a bit more. So yeah, this is our, our only yellow belly, single gene yellow belly pie out of the clutch. I was really hoping for a female yellow belly pie to hold back, but um, it, I mean, it is what it is, right? You can't win them all, but not much pattern to work with, but the pattern is super nice on this boy. Uh, and a little bit at the edge of the tail there. So this guy will be available, um, you know, once he's doing well on frozen thawed rats and I'll make him available since I have his dad already at my disposal. So, but just a nice yellow belly pied. All right, and the last baby of the clutch, my favorite is this girl here. I was super excited that she was the first one out and uh, when I popped her and realized she was female, I was super, super excited. Um, so I'm definitely gonna be holding this girl back. And I do believe that this is a cinnamon yellow belly pied. So at first I thought maybe just cinnamon pied because I wasn't really sure what to look for. But after doing some research, it, it seems like uh, not a lot, not that I could find, not a lot of cinnamon pieds uh, have white lips like that. 
Um, they tend to just have more of a normal cinnamon looking head uh, with no other pattern on the body. Some of them will get this little patch here, but I do believe after talking to a couple people that this is the cinnamon yellow belly pied, uh, which looks quite a bit different, uh, I find, than the cinnamon or the black pastel yellow belly pied. So you can kind of see that difference once in a while in between cinnamon and black pastel. Um, but really, really love this girl. She's so cool. She has kind of a two face. She has her classic eye stripe on this side with the red pupil, which is really cool. And then on the opposite side, she has no, no eye stripe. So that white comes a little bit higher, but really cool girl. I'm super excited to have this female. Um, I can't wait to grow her up. I can't wait to see her after her first shed. So super excited. I was able to hit a female and this girl is going nowhere. She's definitely gonna be held back. I love this little saddle, the extra saddle she got. Super happy about that. Just to add a little bit extra, you know. I do prefer mid uh, to high patterned pieds, but I this girl is just awesome. I, I love the white lip thing. I think that's so cool. So super excited to have this girl. And I can't wait to get some Enchi and Pinstripe into this. Definitely gotta try to bring back some more pattern. And uh, we'll see if Super Enchi can do that in the future. All right. All right guys, so it's a little bit shorter of a video this week um, because it was a smaller clutch. Unfortunately, like I said, we did lose that one baby, uh, which was just super undeveloped, uh, but it was a pied. So we did awesome on the odds. Technically it would have been four out of five uh, of the babies were pied, uh, but because we did lose that one, it obviously we only had three pieds, uh, but which is great. So we kind of had a good mix of, of, what, of what we could have uh, hit in this clutch, which was awesome. I'm really liking that cinnamon uh, yellow belly pied or what I believe to be is a cinnamon yellow belly pied. Uh, if not, it'll just be a cinnamon pied, but either way, I'm super happy with that one. I love that extra little saddle that I ended up getting. So super stoked on that. And uh, I hope you enjoyed this one. Everyone, uh, I hope is having an awesome weekend. Uh, don't forget to stay, stay positive and focused out there and we'll see you next Saturday.